Good morning, everyone. My name is Leanne Allegretto, and I'm going to be bringing you the updates to the Northwest Montana section of our forecast area regarding tonight and tomorrow's winter storm. So let's go over the highlights of what we have updated to the forecast. We now have a higher likelihood of heavy snow for Northwest Montana with the heaviest snow still expected to fall tonight through tomorrow morning, Monday morning. Winds will still be strong, but not as strong as previously forecast. We will continue to forecast periods of visibility less than a quarter mile. Um, all of that is still likely. However, the prolonged blizzard conditions, you know, so several hours of less than a quarter mile visibility are now less likely because the winds are not as strong. And of course, the significantly colder temperatures, we're still expecting those through the week, but they are not looking as cold as they once, as we once thought possible. So some things good, some things bad. So here is a graphic animated to show you the progression of the cold air. These, this is a 850 millibar temperature forecast animation and 850 millibar equates to about 5,000 feet. So we're looking at a progression of cold air beginning basically later today. As of the time that I'm recording this briefing, the cold air has, has gotten stuck at Essex. So um, we are gonna wait and see if that progresses further, and it should, um, especially according to this forecast. And then it will make its way into the remainder of Western, uh, no, excuse me, Northwest Montana and uh, bring with it the winds. Here's the updated snow forecast for tonight, Sunday evening through Monday morning. We're still looking at some pretty hefty snowfall amounts. Most places are looking at eight to 12 inches. Uh, a lot of the populated areas are looking between four to six, all the way up to eight to 12 inches. And um, about the same as you go further west towards the Idaho border as well. So some of the main travel corridors will receive some pretty hefty snow amounts in a small amount of time. So let's go through some of those. This is Mariah's Pass. I'll start uh, the furthest east and make my way west in the areas that I'm going to cover. So I still want to show right here, we're still expecting the highest and most intense snowfall amounts to occur tonight after 5 p.m. and through the overnight hours into Monday morning. And if you recall, that's basically the same time that the winds will be the strongest. So that is the time period that we're expecting the worst travel conditions to occur. Here's Essex, still showing basically the same thing. Heaviest snowfall amounts are occurring this evening through tomorrow morning. West Glacier, pretty hefty amounts. Also showing the 5 p.m. onward time period for the heaviest snow. Kalispell, very much the same thing. And it's got uh, higher amounts actually after 5 a.m. Monday compared to most other places. So the period of heaviest snowfall is gonna be basically all night tonight and through tomorrow morning. And Olney, uh, basically as you head north through the 93 corridor, um, Sunday night, tonight through Monday morning, same thing. So what are the winds that we're talking about? Um, they have lowered, this is a wind gust forecast. The image on the left shows forecasted wind gusts for this evening. And then the graphic on the right shows wind gusts forecast for Monday morning. So as you can see, a lot of 40s in here, um, Essex, West Glacier, all the way to Colum uh, Columbia Falls, Whitefish, Kalispell. Kalispell not as strong, at least this evening, but they will increase through Monday morning. So right when that heaviest period of snowfall is falling, we're going to have gusts in the 30s to 40s for a lot of places. And um, our confidence is pretty high in that forecast. So basically spelling it out from West Glacier to Kalispell, winds will begin strengthening out of the east northeast tonight around 5 to 6 p.m. with the worst winds expected from 10 p.m. onward through late Monday morning, roughly 11 a.m. Whitefish begin to strengthen around 9 to 10 p.m. tonight and then with the strongest worst winds likely from midnight onward through late Monday morning. Big Four, kind of the same story, will begin strengthening around 8 to 10 p.m. tonight with the worst winds expected midnight tonight through late Monday morning. And please give us a call after you receive this and watch it. If you have any questions at all, we are here for you. Thank you.